Hey, what's up, family? I'm Rachel. And I'm Joe. And we are Two, two Crazy, crazy ketos. ketos. We are just 33 days away from KetoCon. And we have a super special video to help get ready for it. And we're going to start it right, right after, after this. this. So if you're new to our channel, welcome. Like I said, my name is Joe. And I'm Rachel. And we're Two Crazy Ketos. And here on our channel, we do different things like product reviews. We do recipe videos. We talk about various keto topics. And then once a week, we sit down on the couch for Keto on the Couch. We just kind of talk about what's going on in our lives for the week. You can find us on different social media platforms like Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. And we also have a website, which is TwoCrazyKetos.com. And that's where you're going to find all of our different recipes. Now, we do upload at least five new videos every single week. So make sure you subscribe to our channel. And if you are subscribe don't forget to hit the little bell icon and that way every single time we upload a new video you'll be alerted to it so i am super excited i don't know about you i'm so excited i'm already packed yeah we are 33 days away from ketocon there's one problem what's that like we're 33 days away from KetoCon, and I don't think my body is KetoCon ready. Well, we're going to fix that right now. Okay. Because, guys, we have something super special for you. So we were watching our good friend Watch Autumn Keto on YouTube. She's the coolest. And she is absolutely, if you're not subscribed to her, you need to go check out her channel. She is so much fun to watch. She does like weekly meal preps, weekly weigh-ins. Mm -hmm. I mean, she's just a lot of fun. I mean, she's so much better meal prepping than I am. I need to like take a yes. lesson from her. She's very on, organized. She's super organized. A I lot more than that. I am. But she is going to KetoCon as well. And so she had put up a video that how she was going to like do this like mini cut, mm -hmm. which is something that we were planning on doing. Yeah. So we reached out to her mm -hmm. and we're going to, in collaboration with her, we're going to do a cut over the next four weeks. Wow. Okay. So do you want, let's check in with Autumn and see what she has to say. Awesome. Hey, Joe and Rachel, I am so glad that you two reached out to me about collabing for this Countdown to KetoCon challenge. We can't wait to Or meet you. what I am calling it, the Cut Down to KetoCon. Ooh, I like that name. Because I really that's like that what name. I'm We're doing. Take that I am making too. cuts every week leading up to KetoCon that's in order to get to in it. the best shape and be looking good and feeling good when I meet. So many people that I'm excited to meet, including you guys. Oh my goodness. We are so excited to meet you in person, Autumn. We're such huge fans. Yeah. So, so what exactly are you going to do for this challenge? So hopping into this challenge, I really just wanted to be intentional about doing things that I have not been making it a point to do over the past couple of months. And that's simple things like eat on a consistent plan and exercise. I'm horrible so at exercise. My goals for this challenge are challenging, but they are pretty simple. Goal number one, I'm going to be tapering my calories every week by 50 calories Again, up until keto to do it. So I'm going to be starting out at 1500 calories and I'm going to be cutting by 50 calories every week until keto con. In addition to cutting calories, I'm also going to be cutting carbs. So right now I'm doing around 20 total carbs. I'm also going to be cutting that by five every Whoa. week oh leading gosh. up to KetoCon. Meaning that last week, I think I'm going to be at five total carbs, which is that basically is carnivore. Dedication. And two of those are zip this. So like, you gotta have zip this. You know, I don't. What, what else can you have? I don't know. Either I don't way, think I can not cut my back problem. To five That's three like, weeks off. So much problem. better than me. <laughs> to amazing. figure that out. But that will definitely be a challenge that I look forward to. And then the final thing that I'm going to do is make it a point to be super consistent with my exercising. So much so that I've actually developed a little schedule of what oh, I'm going to be doing. I've developed uh, an Excel spreadsheet. We so know much I love more Excel. Organized than I am. So I've I developed an Excel man. spreadsheet for all of the exercises that I'm going to be doing. And this is available at www.watchautomketo.com. Yes. Oh, you gotta get that. If you are interested in seeing what I'm doing, but like, feel free to do whatever exercise is gonna be challenging for you. So I'm doing six days of exercise, I'm doing three days of weightlifting per this program, and then three other days of cardio for at least 45 minutes. And that could be dancing, that could be step aerobics, oh, kickboxing, that incline treadmill that I love so much, any sort of exercise, three days weightlifting, three days cardio. So Autumn, is there anything else that you're gonna be doing? Yeah, what else are you doing? I'm still gonna be sticking with my no gum and no Powerade Zero or ice drinks. Um, so that's pretty much no sucralose, 
for the time being. I will have some Zevia, but I'm I've been doing well cutting out those super low laden drinks and I will continue to do that up until the conference. And that's all I'm doing guys. Simple things, but effective things that I know will yield this awesome results. This is gonna be results, so awesome. Getting me yeah. looking and feeling the best I can when we all head to Austin Yay. at the end yes. of June. Once again, thanks so much for reaching out about collabing. I'm so excited to see how we do and I look forward to checking in with yeah, you guys next week. Bye. Oh my goodness, this is so exciting. This is super exciting. I'm such a huge fan of Autumn that I'm like totally geeking out thinking You're about You're becoming a little to... bit of a roadie here. I know, I can't wait to meet her in person. Like I'm totally geeking out. Yeah, I'm super excited about this because especially because we could now like kind of join forces with the two channels and you know, have everybody kind of participate in this challenge and maybe find something that's, you know, like you're struggling with in your life and slowly taper it off over the next 30 days. Yeah, because whether you're going to KetoCon or not, yep. like join the journey with us and for the next four weeks, let's get that's rid of something. That's the whole goal of this program. Yeah. So now that we know what Autumn is doing, let's talk about what we are going to do to get ready for KetoCon. So right now, as of today, KetoCon is 33 days away. We so are scary. leaving on June 27th. So we're going to start this challenge this coming Monday, which is the 27th, I believe. Yeah. Okay. So we're going to do a couple things together, similar to what Autumn is doing. And then we're also going to do a couple of our own things. So first thing we're going to do is I am starting off at 185 pounds. Right. And I am starting out at 144 pounds. And the goal of this isn't so much weight loss, but it's toning and slimming down. Yeah. And, and getting some things out of our bodies that like maybe that we're struggling with. Yeah, okay. we've got crutches. Yep, so I am going to start off at 2,100 calories, mm -hmm. and Rachel is starting off at- 1,550, yeah. 1,550 calories. And what we're gonna do, Autumn is dropping hers by 50 calories a week. We're gonna drop our calories by 100 calories every week up oh until KetoCon. Oh my gracious. Okay, but I know we're not trying to one-up Autumn because Autumn's got something on us because- She's Really We've been following no more than 30 total carb protocol, um, which there's been lots of days where we didn't hit that 30, but that's been our limit. Yeah. For the next four weeks, we're going to limit our total carbs to no more than 15 total carbs. You know what that means for me, though? What that means that mean? I cannot eat a full bar at all. Ooh, that's true. With the exception of maybe, I think, the dang bar. There's maybe one or two bars, but that dang. would be... Really that would be maxing me out because like I think the the smallest bar I have is like 12 total carbs, which means I can only have like a half a bar if I even have enough room for that. You know, I love you. Yes. Okay. So, so we're going to cut down to 15 total carbs. We're going to cut a hundred calories each week off. Mm -hmm. And then here's the big one, guys. Get ready for this? I, I got to make sure that Rachel doesn't beat me on this one. We are eliminating our dessert day between now and KetoCon. <laughs> Goodbye, delicious ice cream. Except for one week. Later. One week, not this coming week, but the following week is when Caleb is graduating from high school. My mom is coming down. Your mom is going to be here, even though your mom already lives here. Well, but we are, we're setting the bar that high, though. We are celebrating. Graduation. That is it. That is the only day we will have our ice cream. But we still have to do our 15 total carbs, which means only one serving instead of the double serving. So, but that's, that's it. That's it. So, no ice cream for the next four weeks. I seriously am, like, I'm saddened. <laughs> So now in addition to that, you're going to do something on top of what we're doing collectively, right? I made this stupid commitment <laughs> to bike ride five miles a day. Which you're doing awesome with. I am. But, but you're going to do that every day. But now I'm, I'm in it. So. Like now I've committed. <laughs> Well, Autumn is working out six days a week. She's kicking my butt. She's inspiring me, honestly, because like I really was not even considering like any kind of working out because it is the summertime and I'm doing landscaping and it's hot outside. But I don't know. After week one, I may even have to consider getting my butt into the gym at least for the next three weeks because she is there? challenging me yeah. to maybe get in there and get back into weightlifting and stuff like that. We'll have to see how this week goes. And now the other thing, the last thing that we're considering doing, oh wait, I forgot. 
the thing that I am giving up because I'm not doing the gym thing. I think you're blanking out on it. I'm blanking out on this. So, true confession time. I mentioned it on True Case, on Two Crazy Keto's family group. I struggle with a soda problem. I love my soda. My name is Joe, and I'm addicted to soda. Yes. I love my Diet Coke. I have days where I can drink five, six, even seven cans of it. It could be bad. It's the one thing that I haven't given up over the last two and a half years. I would give it up for a couple of weeks, come back to it, give it up, go back and forth, go back and forth. So we had that big sale on Zevia. It was perfect timing. No more aspartame. I am giving up aspartame. I think it's going to be for the best. For these next 30 days. And hopefully I can continue it on if I can just get past the dollar a can on Zevia. But right now I have enough Zevia to get me by for a little while. I feel like you've got enough Zevia to like <laughs> handle like a walking dead and that, episode. That is going to be huge for me to give up the aspartame for the next basically 32 days, 33 days for, for at minimum. And plus KetoCon. We're not going to be able to find a Diet Coke at KetoCon. I'll be drinking Zevias there too. So. Yeah, probably. So that is what we're doing. And then what we're considering doing is for the last five days of this challenge right the last five days we're going to probably do only keto brick and fat so we're still thinking about that one right we're still we're still it's it's in my mind now it's in our mind so yeah we're going to see how this goes so here's the thing guys we're gonna we're inviting you guys along with us and along with autumn and her audience to join us with this let us know down below what is something that you are struggling with that you'd like to maybe taper off over the next 30 days. Yeah, for just four weeks. For just See what four happens. Weeks. What could you get rid of? And just do a slow cut. Cut out. You know, if you're like me and you're a soda junkie, maybe you're drinking four cans a day, maybe drop it to three cans or two cans or, you know, each week drop off a can, whatever it may be. Maybe if you're like me and you hate exercising, like yeah, this commit four to weeks, two we're days doing of exercising it. a week, then three days of exercise, and then four days. Work so, yourself up. But join us in on this countdown to KetoCon. Also, maybe you'd like to be like me and give up coffee for this. Oh, no, no, I'm not doing that. <laughs> Psych. So I am so excited. Yes. These next 30 days aren't going to be sad. They're going to be awesome as we sort of like take four weeks to kind of work out a couple crutches that we yep. have. I think it's going to be really good. I'm super excited for Autumn and what she's going to be able to experience during this cut. And hopefully you guys will have an incentive to maybe get rid of something that you've been like, how do I start this? Or how do I get rid of this? This Maybe this is the time. Yep. So, I mean, just like, you know, our Two Crazy Ketos family group, we want to be here to encourage you and you guys can encourage us to let us know what you're going to do down below. Yeah. And again, if you have not seen Autumn's channel, go take a look at it. Go do check out her channel. A favor. You will not stop laughing. She is so funny and she has so much good information. And I'm just excited to be able to to be working with her on this project. Oh my gosh, this is so exciting. I, and I also, like just side note, want to go to Trader Joe's with her mom. Yes, oh my gosh, her mom is hysterical. Her mom is super cool. I think her mom and my mom going to Trader Joe's would be That would be a you funny would... video. Autumn, we're gonna have to do that. We're gonna have to get our moms together Send and have moms. them <laughs> go into Trader Joe's. That would be awesome. So that is our video for today, guys. Hopefully you liked what you saw. If you did, do us a favor, hit that like button down below. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and to watch Autumn Keto. And if you are a subscriber, go ahead and click that bell icon and that way every single time we upload a new video, you'll be alerted to it. And again, if you're interested, go check out that spreadsheet on um, Autumn's website at watchautumnketo.com. I just want to nerd out with that organization. <laughs> I love it. Until next time. Bye. Bye. Bye.